Musician. Musician, okay. And what kind of music? I do piano music. Okay, great. Loud, angry piano music. Do you want me to say your last name or? Svensgaard. No one's going to remember it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Hey guys, this is Keith with Scottish Kill Shop, and I'm here with Avery Sven something. I don't know. I don't know how to pronounce it. Svensgard. I don't. I haven't had my coffee yet. Adrian Svensgard, and <laughs> his name's Avery. Okay, deal with it. Um, so Avery's a musician, a piano player here in the city. Now, uh, have you worn a kilt before, or were you a kilt virgin up to this moment? No, this is my first time wearing a kilt, and I have to say, I'm very impressed. Um, I, it's it's like. You don't really realize how much your pants can strike to you sometimes. <laughs> right? I'm saying, and, and because, I mean, I'm not, I'm not assuming anything, but us hipsters, you know, we wear the tight pants. And, you know, sometimes that can be a little constricting in certain areas. Um, you know, do you, do you feel a little loose and limber now you got the kill? Like you could take on the world? Oh, yeah, absolutely. It's very, um, sorry, my brain just... <laughs> We'll do it again. Yeah. So, you know, us, us hipster types, we're always wearing these super tight pants. And, you know, this can be a little constricting downstairs. Do you find that there's a freedom to the kilt? Do you feel kind of like you want to just beat your chest and go, yeah. Well, speak for yourself about those tight pants. But absolutely, even compared, to, even compared to normal pants, there's something there. You can't really, like, I don't know, do a high kick or whatever. Um, uh, it gives you a freedom of movement and mobility. And I'm just going to say this. Take it for what you will easy access okay it's from a scottish kill shop now would you rock a kilt to a show like when you're playing a show with your band or you're behind the piano doing a jerry lee lewis like high leg kick would you would you do the kilt absolutely i think that um it's it's not mainstream enough that it's not gonna get an impact you know it's at that it's right at that sweet spot um and it's also like they have they don't just have like the super traditional scottish kilts i really like the kind of punk ones like with all the all the little dongles or whatever you call those right you know there's so much variety and and too that's one of the great things about scottish kill shop is and we're talking about 200 tartans in the store and we're always adding more and you know all kinds of uh, accessories and side pieces and pockets there's there's uh there's something for everybody you know that's what we're saying so go to scottish kill shop get your own look like my friend avery let's call him avery s you know i mean won't bother with the last name look like my friend avery be stylish be a khaki king scottish kill shop